How do you say yes without saying yes? Hi, I'm Jeff McQuillan coming to you from beautiful Los Angeles, California and ESLPOD.com. There are lots of different ways of telling someone yes, you want to do something or agreeing with someone. Some of them are informal and some of them are formal. It's useful to know different ways of saying yes because you're going to hear them in conversation and read them and you may also want to use them in your own English speaking. Let's start with a very informal way of saying yes, and that is, uh-huh, uh-huh, is something that you will hear in informal English, and it's just another way of either agreeing with someone or letting someone know that you're listening. So sometimes your wife might say to you, um, honey, dear, and you go, yes, meaning yes, I'm listening, go ahead. More commonly, we might say, uh-huh. Uh-huh, then, can mean yes, meaning I will do something. For example, honey, will you take out the trash? Will you take the garbage outside? And you'll go, uh-huh. That means yes, in an informal way. I talk more about using aha uh -huh in Daily English 289 communication problems. Take a look at that lesson if you want some more information. A second way of saying yes that could be used both in an informal and a formal situation is the adverb absolutely. Do you want to go to the store today? Absolutely. Do you want to do this new project and have it done by five o'clock? Absolutely. It's a way of saying that, yes, you will do something enthusiastically. Absolutely, as an adverb, has other meanings, however, so you need to understand that it doesn't always mean yes. For example, if you say, I trust my friend absolutely, that means completely, so it's a slightly different use. Or if you say, I absolutely love my new car, once again, that means completely. It doesn't mean yes in the sense of you're enthusiastic about doing something. A third way of saying yes is by all means. This one is a little bit more formal. If someone asks you, do you have time to talk to me for five minutes? You might say, by all means, let's talk. It's a little more formal. You won't hear it in daily conversation as much. But it does mean, in this case, yes. By all means can also sometimes be used to give someone permission. Someone may say, may I sit down here? And you could say, by all means, have a seat. It's a way of giving permission, of saying, yes, you can do that. Finally, a word that we use, again, probably more in formal settings, but it can be used in formal or informal, is simply Agreed. We should go to the store today, don't you think? Agreed. That means, yes, I agree with you. If you agree that you can improve your English by listening to English, well, then go to our website at eslpod.com and check out our unlimited English membership. If you like this video, please like us, share us with your friends and family, and follow us on either Facebook or Twitter. From beautiful Los Angeles, California, I am Jeff McQuillan. Thanks for watching.